Yo, what's up? It's Azolai. So today we're going to do an in-depth analysis of the Wheelman Armor Mod and find out how much damage resistance your vehicle actually gets if you equip this armor mod. So we're going to use a standard Warthog to quantify the damage resistance, but there's one thing that you should be aware of and that's when you shoot heavily armored vehicles like the Warthog, some of your bullets will actually ricochet and do no damage. So for this test to be statistically sound, we'll be shooting at the Warthog's wheels. The Warthog's wheels are actually a weaker area of the vehicle where bullets do not ricochet and every bullet does damage. Alright, enough with that. So now we'll move on to the test. So if a player does not have wheelmen on, it will take 86 bullets from an AR to destroy a warthog by shooting at the wheels. However, if there is one wheelman, then it will take 95 bullets to destroy a warthog by shooting the wheels. Now remember, the Wheelman Armor Mod stacks vehicle damage resistance for every player that has it equipped, so if we have two players with Wheelman, it will take 106 bullets to destroy the Warthog by shooting its wheels. Alright, so using this information we can do some basic calculations and account for error, and what we get in the result is that without Wheelman, you get a 0% vehicle damage resistance or VDR boost. I mean, what a surprise, right? And then with one Wheelman, you will get around an 11% VDR boost, with two Wheelman, you will get around a 22% VDR boost, and with three Wheelman, you will get around a 33% vehicle damage resistance boost. So in my opinion, that's pretty awesome. Also interesting to note is that Scorpions and Wraiths can only hold two players at a time, so their maximum vehicle damage resistance boost is 22% for two Wheelmen. Alright, so next we're going to revisit the effect of Wheelman on EMP duration. So the standard EMP duration on a Warthog is exactly 3.0 seconds, so you won't be able to move your vehicle for this amount of time. But with Wheelman, the EMP duration decreases to 1.5 seconds, so that's a 50% decrease in time. Unfortunately, unlike damage resistance, EMP recovery time does not stack and decrease if you have multiple Wheelman. Regardless, this is definitely something to consider, especially when using air vehicles like Banshees or Wasps and heavy vehicles like Scorpions, Mantises, and Wraiths, because being immobilized by an EMP for 1.5 seconds versus 3.0 seconds could be the difference between surviving or dying in your vehicle, so I highly recommend equipping Wheelmen while using such vehicles. Alright, so that's it for this video. I want to give a shout out to Phoenix Ashes and Ukraine Train for helping me out with this Wheelman analysis. Also, if you want to know how to play Warzone in custom games, I'll have a link in the description to a full step-by-step -step tutorial by press. Alright guys, I hope you learned something new in this video, so thank you for watching, and as always, until next time.